I've been looking everywhere for this. It's so hard to find this in Canada. I had to order this on Amazon. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. It's called tie-in spice or tie-in seasoning with lime, it says right here. Here's what it shows on the cover. It says everything tastes better. So as you can see in that picture, like they put this on everything. It's like an all-purpose seasoning. They put it on avocados, um, orange, mango, um, pineapple, corn, carrots, watermelon, apple, juice even, you name it. Like, And when I was there, they did like... They would put they would have it on fruits sometimes and even in juice it tastes really good i've got mango right here and pineapple and some cucumber just because cucumber is a really neutral flavor i want to see if you know if this tie-in spice can do its job on cucumbers uh, take a look at the ingredients here dried chili peppers sea salt citric acid, dehydrated lime juice, and silicon dioxide oh, to prevent caking. So far, my taste buds love everything in here. I just can't wait. So here's what the bottle looks like. Let's open this up. Oh, it's sealed here. It has a nice, neat little seal. This right here. Before I do that, I'm going to try the fruits on their own. Nice and fresh. Super soft mango. Juicy looking pineapple. Let me try a little bit of it by itself first. Oh. <clears throat> this is this is exactly made for me. Let me show you what that looks like right now. I guess if you don't want to sprinkle it over everything, you can just have it, you know, like in, in a little plate on the side and just dip it dip your fruits in there oh man so excited for this i know to some of you it might be really confusing that why is there like you know chili flakes or a sour lime spice over mango but it actually enhances the flavor of the mango even though the mango is delicious on its own it's nice and sweet but when you add this spice it does some magic in a, it complements it in a really nice way mm. the mango is a win let's try this uh, pineapple It 
doesn't take anything away at all from the natural sweetness and the natural scent, the natural flavors of the pineapple. It doesn't take anything away at all. It simply just adds a little more kick to it, you know. Let's see what it does to a cucumber. I love that as well. On cucumber, it's... Because the cucumber is so plain, I feel like I'll, I could never eat cucumber without this again. Mm. Honestly, I don't even feel like talking anymore. I just want to keep eating this stuff. You seriously have to try this for yourself. So glad I found you. I wish I had some watermelon, some oranges, like, I just want to try that on everything right now. Hmm. Can't believe Canadian grocery stores don't carry this. If they did though, I'm sure it'd be a hit. There's one more Mexican spice that I've heard of. It's in liquid form and it's called chimoy sauce. It's supposed to be tamarind. If correct me if I'm wrong, it's supposed to be tamarind. I haven't tried that one as well. Now that I've, I see how good this is, I have to try that. If you think fruits are refreshing on their own, you haven't tried it with tie-in. It makes them taste super fresh. This is how much is reasonable. I feel like you don't want to put too much. It'll be overwhelming. But you want it to be a decent amount. That definitely satisfies any sour cravings you might have. Now I gotta get out of here, so please subscribe to my channel and hit like, and I'll see you in my next video.